Okay, so now we're gonna prep tracks so that they actually mix well. And we're gonna deal with cue points and beat grids and loops and go ahead and get things um, working well with each other. So this track, I've already got a few things set. I'm gonna go ahead and just delete those so that we can do them together. Let's imagine that this track was blank and I had just loaded it up. Loaded it up. So I would go ahead and the first thing I would do would be to click into grid and then press this nice auto button. And then Tractor is going to automatically beat grid this track for us. It's going to drop a beat grid there and stretch it across the track. And ideally what we should see here are these white lines matching up with these peaks. If they don't match up, you need to use these little buttons here to change the BPM of the grid and make sure that the white lines line up with the peaks of the waveform. Then what we've got is a very, very accurate BPM for this song so that when we sync that BPM up with the BPM of another song, the sync is as solid and clean as possible. Once you've got an accurate beat grid, you can go ahead and lock that. Then we're gonna go back into cue and using our controller, we're gonna set some cue points. So we're gonna go to the beginning of the song, that downbeat, and we're gonna go ahead and just press button one. And you can see that Brett button one just turned blue. Button two, three, and four, or cue point pads two, three, and four, are clear. Um, that means nothing is stored in those open slots. They're open. And if we go to the next beat, this one's a snare here, I believe, we can go ahead and store a cue point there. So now we have one and two. We can do this on the fly. Now one thing I want to show you real quickly, when you're doing these kinds of beat jekylls, right now it's all free form, but you can use the quantize button here so that when you jump back to the beginning of the song, it does it in time and everything stays on the one. So no matter what, even if your time isn't perfect, the song stays in time.